Hi, it's Miss Voiles, and today I'm going to be talking about FAFSA verification. Verification is the process your school uses to confirm that the data reported on your FAFSA form is accurate. If you're selected for verification, your school will request additional documentation that supports the information that you reported. If you are selected for verification, don't assume that you're being accused of doing anything wrong. Some people are selected for verification at random, and some schools verify all students' FAFSA forms. All you need to do is provide the documentation your school asks for, and be sure to do so by the school's deadline, or you won't be able to get federal student aid. If you are selected for verification, the first thing you need to do is review your student aid report. Your student aid report, or SAR, summarizes the information you submitted and your expected family contribution. If you've been selected for verification, the SAR will include a notice alerting you. The school may also send you a letter telling you that you've been picked for verification. Next, you need to gather requested documentation. If selected for verification, you will be asked to submit documentation that proves the information you submitted on the FAFSA was accurate. The areas that you might need to confirm include adjusted gross income, income taxes paid, household size, number of household members in college, and tax-exempt interest income. Non-tax filers, meaning those who are not required to submit a federal tax return, will have to submit a statement along with other supporting documentation such as a W-2 or 1099 forms. Some applicants also will have to submit a verification of non-filing letter from the IRS. After that, you'll have to fill out the FAFSA verification form. The colleges requiring verification will send you a FAFSA verification worksheet to complete. You will fill in all the requested information and not leave any sections blank. If a field doesn't apply to you, enter zero or N slash A as needed. Be sure to sign and date the FAFSA verification form before mailing it in. Finally, contact the school financial aid office. After submitting your FAFSA verification form or updating your FAFSA, contact the school's financial aid office. If your financial aid package was adjusted based on your FAFSA verification and you need more aid, talk to the financial aid representatives about your other options, such as additional student loans. If you have any other questions about FAFSA verification, feel free to reach out to your college advisor. Thank you for watching and have a great day.